Hi, Scott Lackman from 4510 TV. Very excited to be here today. A new aquatic centre has opened in Caboolture in the grounds of St Peter's Primary School on Beer Barham Road. We're here with pool manager John Jeffrey. Good morning, John. G'day, Scott. How are you? Very good, mate. Um, I'm pretty excited, so you as the pool manager must be excited. Tell us what we've got here. Yeah, look, what we've got, we've got um, two pools. We've got a 25 metre lap pool which is um, heated all year round to around 30 degrees and we've also got a 15 metre learn to swim pool which is only um, 0.8 metre to a metre deep yes. and um, that one there is designed just purely to teach kids to swim, yeah. learn to swim from little babies right through to um, you know, primary school children yeah. up to secondary school. John you talked about there's, there's lessons for kids, um, who's heading up uh, teaching the kids how to swim here at your, at your facility? Yeah, okay, we have um, our, our squad coach and our learn to swim coordinator at the moment is a, a girl called Kyra Bradfield and she comes from a, a strong swimming pedigree. She's represented Queensland and Australia in butterfly right. and she's a young girl who's really motivated to teach and coach kids. It's a real passion of hers and that came across when she spoke to me from the, from the start yeah. and I'm just wrapped to have her on board and she's uh, really confident with the kids and she really understands exactly what's required yeah. and uh, she'll certainly be able to teach all levels of swimmers. John, let's start at the very start of this interview. Um, the pool is open to the public, let's be very clear on that. It is in the grounds of St Peter's Primary School but very much open to the public? Correct, We've um, and it's important that the message gets out that we, we, we're open for business. So we've got um, every, all, all programs are up and running and we're all ready to go. And we've got, obviously we've got plenty of kids signed up from the school, but we've also got other kids signed from outside of the school. And it's important that everyone gets that message, yes. that it's a, it's a community facility. It's designed for people from all walks of life to come in and be able to learn to swim. And uh, we're happy to take all comers, for yeah. sure. Uh, and John, uh, part of the, the new aquatic centre being open here, you're looking for some corporate or some community business partners as well? Yeah, correct. I mean, we, we obviously want to involve the community in whatever way we can. So if um, any community interest groups want to come in and have a talk to us about possible plans that they may have that they think they can utilise a facility for, we're, we're only too happy to accommodate them. Yeah, and it's not so much uh, sponsorship or, or dollars, it's more that interaction and people coming and using the facility and by them using it, maybe they'll tell their friends or other groups that they can use it as well? Well, in any business, you know, word of mouth is the key and yeah. look, we think we're, we're well set up and we think that we've got the right people around us to make sure this, this thing works well for everyone and and uh, yeah the more community people we can get in here the better community spirit we can build and yeah. you know really it's, a, it's really about making sure that people are comfortable we're putting smiles on people's faces and we're not charging the earth for what we're trying yeah. to do here, you know? and at the end of the day um, building long long life skills of learning how to swim correct and I mean at the end of the day teach your children how to swim it's, it's a major major important step in their life especially in Queensland the climate we live in you know, most people have got backyard pools or whatever around the place and it's very important that the kids can, you know, at least understand water safety and know how to save themselves in a, in a panic situation. Yep. John, we're going to do some overlay footage uh, while we're talking of the facilities and there are some kids here today um, about to start a, a, yep. a group. Um, what other lessons, we're not just talking about kiddies, um, mature age people, there's facility here there as well? Uh, yeah, as correct. Well. We're going to do, we're actually going to do um, Learn, adult learn to swim classes because it's you know community has changed a lot there's a lot of people that have never been taught to swim and particularly with um, immigration and, and these types of countries that really haven't had the same facilities that Australians have had so we're making that facility available as well um, we have qualified teachers ready to go to teach you know adults of all ages really okay. correct techniques in how to swim uh, so John also part of the facility there's there's um, there's things here for remedial um, whether it be physiotherapy for, for, for after injuries talk to us about a couple of those uh, yeah those well facilities. obviously you know with, with with any types of water activities you know the, the buoyancy factor people that have bad knees or are recovering from operations. It's a perfect situation even in the learn to swim pool to be able to walk up and down the pool. Yeah. Takes a lot of the weight out of it, makes it a lot easier and, 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 and will speed up their recovery. Also for people that have you know chronic and long term injuries where it's difficult to run, difficult to ride bikes, I mean, you know, swimming is a great activity to try to keep fit. Yeah. And um, you know, it's it's there, we've got we've got um, ramp access for disabled. 
and we'll have a look at that in a minute, but it's very important that uh, people understand we're here to try to make sure it's easy for everybody. Yep. And you've got the change room facilities, showers, etc. Yep, yep, and we've got private cubicle facilities, which, you know, being a modern facility, which is, is brand new, um, it's got the latest sort of state-of-the-art type operation there, and, you know, people can get changed in comfort and privacy, and um, we can also do look after their valuables and those types of things as Excellent. well. John, uh, John Jeffrey, uh, manager of the newly built and, uh, and newly opened aquatic facility. Uh, Saint, it's on the grounds of St Peter's Primary School in Caboolture, but certainly open to the public and, and we welcome that, John. That's it. Is there anything you'd like to cap off on, mate? Oh, look, uh, as long as everyone understands, you know, we have a vast array of products available from learn to swim, babies and toddlers. We're looking for um, adult learn to swim. We do aqua aerobics. Um, people can walk, swim, uh, we have multiple lanes. Yeah, so this is my invitation for the people of Caboolture. Come down any time, we're open from 6.15 in the morning until 6pm at night. They can ring in on 54957725. And uh, I'm quite happy to show them through the facility and answer any questions that they might have. So come on down.